those are definitely black mambas. Snakes are always a sign of the forces of darkness. Okay, wait, wake up. Hey. Gal, I just had the worst nightmare. I dream we were surrounded by snakes. I think we should uh, wait until tomorrow and talk when Gwen is with us. Is there anything else to talk about? Yes, there is. But I don't want to say any more about it until Gwen is with us. It concerns the three of us. Call you in the morning to see how you feel. Okay. Good night, Teresa. You can wait. What is it? I know that that you don't think it's fair to Gwen, but I can't live another night without knowing. And still in there. I think we know what he's decided. Yeah. Maybe we do. If Ethan chooses Teresa, the cranes will destroy my family. said, Julia. Alistair's threats are not the reason why I lied about what Sheridan said under hypnosis. If you weren't afraid, then why? Why make up all that psycho babble about Sheridan's guilt over our mother's death? I believe God will forgive me for lying about Martin Fitzgerald. Because the past can cast a long shadow over love, and I wanted to save Sheridan and Louise that pain. You seem to be implying that Louise and Sheridan have some kind of relationship. I think they could. It's obvious that they both want to. Besides, Sheridan was just a little child when the murder happened. There's no reason to punish her for it now. I just couldn't let that secret destroy their future when I've got so many secrets of my own. Oh, you did it for love. I should have known you were always such a romantic. Julian, I just saved you from prison. Now don't come on to me like the pig that you are. I might change my mind. I'm just showing my gratitude. I'm a romantic, too. You don't know the first thing about romance. I'm just glad that my lie will give Sheridan and Louise a chance to admit their feelings for each other. I wanted so badly to help you find out what happened to your father. I'm glad I didn't kill him, though. I couldn't bear to see the hatred in your eyes. 
I wouldn't have hated you, Sheridan. I can never hate you. Your threats worked, Father. Eve convinced Louise that Sheridan did not kill Martin Fitzgerald. Which means that Sheridan and Louise have one less obstacle to being together. Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. Well, you better worry about it. You find a way to destroy that relationship. We can never let them be together. They must never discover the truth. 